Hey, what's up? My name's Melinda. I'm a Sephora beauty director, and I'm gonna show you how I created this festival hair look. It's so cute with all these braids. It's easy, it's up and out of your way. I love how it turned out, so let's jump right in. All right, so these are super important to this look. They're the Sephora Collection Snag Free Elastics. They're just really discreet, and you can't really see them, so the look looks way more polished. I'm gonna section my hair before I jump into the French braid, and I'll be right back. All right, so I've sectioned my hair into this little mohawk section, so you can see See, it's flat there, it's flat there, but I have all of my hair up here to actually create my French braid, setting myself up for success. I'm gonna start with just a thin layer of hair up front. This is a trick that my hairstylist Anna told me. Starting thin will make it so you can really see the braid from the beginning instead of it starting further back. So I'm going to section into three and start my French braid. All right, so that's about the end. Once I reach where I wanna basically create my ponytail, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna grab my hair elastic and I'm just gonna secure my braid. And then you can kind of pull it out a bit just to add a little bit more volume to it. And then we can take out our sections and start our ponytail. All right, so now's the easy part. We're just gonna take all of our hair and throw it into a ponytail. This is why I love this style for a festival because if you're on second or third day hair and you wanna throw up your somewhat dirty hair, this style's so cute, but it conceals that for you. I'm just gonna take my fingernails and kind of brush through. It doesn't have to be perfect. I'm going for a more textured look. And then when you get it where you want it, can grab a hair tie. I'm using a more traditional, thicker band just because I have a good amount of hair and I want it to stay nice and tight and secure. And your braid is gonna be in there as well. And then I'm just gonna give it three wraps, whatever you need for the thickness of your hair. You can give it a little bit of a zhuzh and it even kind of pushes the braid up a bit when you pull it tighter, get a little extra volume. And then use those fingernails again or like a light comb just to kind of pull some of the hair out and finesse. So you can see this is kind of what it looks like from the side. You can keep kind of playing with it. I have extensions, so I'm gonna make sure that all of my tracks are covered. And then you're set. All right, so now we're gonna add a little bit of fun to our ponytail. I wanna add some more braids. I'm gonna start on my right side. So you can pull from wherever you want. I like to pull from kind of like the right upper corner of my ponytail. And then this is a normal braid, no French braid necessary. So you'll section it in three and just work your way down. So this definitely doesn't have to be perfect. The whole look is super textured. So if you pick up some hair or lose some hair in this braid, don't stress. I know it's hard to like not want it to be perfect, but it'll all come together in the end. So now that I'm at the end of my braid, I'm just going to let it loose for a second and kind of pull out the braid and poof it out a bit to get a little more volume, a little bit more of that undone feeling. And then we can secure it at the end. And once you're done securing it, I like to go in just once more. You can kind of pull that band down a bit to give you a little bit more width and then pull that braid out even more. I like that kind of messy undone look. and it just kind of hangs in the pony like that, and then we'll add one to the other side. All right, one braid down, one more to go. I'm just gonna turn around and get started. All right, so we're gonna grab another piece from the top here, like so, and then you can just start braiding from here, three sections. Now, if your arms are not sore, then you're a lot stronger than I am. Third braid for this style, <laughs> and I'm getting my arm workout in. All right, so once you get to the end, you can just hold it at the bottom and you're gonna just pull from the bottom up to kind of loosen some of those pieces, and make it a little bit more undone looking. And we can take an elastic and secure it. I will say, make sure you wrap the elastic until it is entirely tight. Otherwise, it kind of falls out or it kind of bubbles up and you can see it in your hair. You want it nice and secure. All right, and one more zhuzh. And voila. All right, so for this, I'm gonna grab my piece of hair from underneath. That way you can't see where it's really coming from and it's even more discreet. And we're gonna pull it all the way around the hair tie. You can see it's already disappeared. 
wrap it again. Depending on how long your hair is, I'm gonna get one more wrap in. Once you run out of length, you can grab just your old school hairpin and put that just in place. I'm gonna put an extra one since it's a festival. We're gonna be dancing. You wanna make sure everything's secure and you're good. So this is what it looks like from behind. It's super cute. You have a couple braids. You have your wrapped pony and then the French braid from top. All right, to finish up, I'm just gonna be using a little bit of hairspray. This is from Moroccan Oil. It's a luminous hairspray with medium hold. I like the medium because it's not gonna make your hair like crunchy, but it's enough that it's gonna last all day. What else is really cool about this is it's luminous, so it's gonna add shine and a little bit of texture to your ponytail. All right, so I'm just going to basically butterfly my hair out from the ponytail and give it a little spritz and then kind of just lift it up. It's gonna wake up my waves and keep them nice and voluminous throughout the day. So I'm just going to spray a little bit on that side and a little bit on this side. And then I'll just use my fingers to kind of smooth those pieces down, place them where you want them. Just these little baby hairs. And you're set. All right, I love how fun this turned out. I think it's really comfortable and it's up and out of the way. So when you're at the festival and you're dancing, you don't have to worry about it. Be sure to like and subscribe so you can see more from us and I'll see you all next time. Bye.